again. Hi, we're back. Hello, hiya. <laughs> um, at the moment, uh, Tilly's just enjoying some good old fashioned homemade milk. Hi, right, babes. Yeah. Well, the exciting thing today is she's almost, very almost, one week old, isn't she, Mummy? At the moment, we're one, two, three, four, five hours off. Six, technically, if you believe in that whole kind of daylight savings and whatnot. Um, yeah. But she's she's doing all right, isn't she? Yeah. Um, she's apparently had quite an eventful day today. Uh, I've had an eventful day to do. I managed to get a good four hours sleep. More than mummy got. <laughs> yes. <laughs> um, but she's had a really exciting day today, hasn't she, mummy? Yes, she has. Yeah. Uh, had a little uh, meeting with a boy in neonatal unit and the little boy was two pounds until he made friends with him while she was having her um, observations and books. Two pounds? So he was two pounds, the baby. Wow, so she must look like Godzilla compared so to him. that's what the midwife said. I'm not calling you fat babes, but you are yeah. a... You're, you're a bit of a heifer. <laughs> but we love you. We love cuddly. <laughs> Well, so she's uh, she's met some boys, not yeah. to my liking. I have serious words with her yeah. about that. Um, she's also had a bit of an episode, hasn't she? Yeah, because Tilly had a little poo in her nappy. So Grandma and me, or well, Grandma and I, sorry, were changing Tilly's bottom. And as we did so, Tilly decided to do a very, very big poo. Uh, projected it across her entire cot. So the poor midwife had to come and clean the entire cot and Tilly was covered, absolutely covered. So that was very exciting. Mm. So Daddy missed a good one there. Well make sure we play this one at your 18th Matilda as well. Yeah, you know, just make sure all your friends know about how to state your life. It's clean now though. Yeah, it's all been cleaned. It's fine. It was gross. She so. looks clean enough. Also yeah. today she's sporting something uh, a little braver, a bit more fashionable. A bit she's, colourful. She's gone away from the plains. Sorry, well, that's a bit of a cleavy shot. <laughs> 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 yeah, she's sporting something a little bit more fashionable. Um, Daddy bought her a new baby clothes. I did. I don't know anything about fashion. Very lucky. I've uh, taken um, some tips from our good friend Jean and I'm going for something floral. Good yeah. So It's always a safe bet with girls, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So, um, so yeah, also tonight um, we were supposed to be at the Ed Sheeran concert where Hannah and my parents are right now, yeah. but this is so much better. So, so much better. We're very, very, very happy to spend our evening with our baby. Yeah. I'm, I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking. Daddy! <laughs> so, she's, um, we, were, we were hoping to try and get her to wake up at some point. Um, well, I don't think that's going to happen. No. It's pretty chilled. You need to put those melons away, Mummy. <laughs> They're full of milk. <laughs> and she's got a little bow. Daddy put a bow on her head. Where's her bow? Yeah, bow on her head. Grandma bought Tilly a little bow. Put on her head. Oh, very nice. So she put that on the head to make her look like a girl. Oh, she's very pink today. Ah, mm. oh, beautiful baby. Um, but yet again, she's got her eyes closed. She's always got her eyes closed. She's having a sleep. She's happy. Well, I don't think we're going to get much more out of it at the moment. She's usually wide awake by now. Um, but we'll catch up on her one week birthday. Yeah. And see um, see how she feels one week later after a big arrival. So, um, yeah, if you're still watching these, thanks for, thanks for watching, <laughs> all ten of you. Um, and we'll, we'll keep it going at least till we leave the hospital for the big day, which could be, well, it's the moment it's Friday, but... It could be sooner, couldn't it? Oh, well, we hope so, but let's try and get out for the weekend. Okay. Okay, bye for now.